their history. We've already had two good reviews on these uh, four, four men, or five men. Okay, make sure you're rereading pages 359 to 392. You will have a test, and I believe it's also a map on this as well. Um, one of the things that, I'll, I'll cover that in a bit, but one of the things we need to cover is this area right here. The Pacific Northwest and the Southwest, we did not cover too much, and I wanna make sure that y'all Remember your states, the last place we stopped off was like in the Midwest in this area region right here where Texas is. So I'm gonna review some of the states because as I was quizzing all this past week, y'all did not know kind of these right here. Okay, so it is Washington, Oregon, California, it's Nevada, Idaho, Montana, Wyoming, Colorado, Utah, Arizona, and New Mexico. This region y'all should know already, okay? But this part we don't, we don't have not gotten to know it. Don't, uh, don't forget the oceans. This is the Pacific Ocean on this side, Atlantic Ocean over here. This is, we're bordered by Canada on the north and we're bordered by Mexico here in the south. This is the Gulf of Mexico right here. Make sure you're also reviewing your major cities in Texas and that's something that I specifically had asked for, so I will like I've been doing, I will randomly ask you on that. Also, make sure you're going through these pages, like I said a little while ago, pages 359 to 392. George Washington Carver, okay, um, there were two major things that I want you to learn about him. Um, he was a professor and a director at Tuskegee Institute. He was invited by uh, Booker T. Washington to fulfill the role of director uh, of agriculture at T the Tuskegee Institute. But he graduated from Iowa State University and some of y'all are confusing that fact, those two facts. So make sure you separate those two. Also, he was known for helping a lot of farmers in the southern states help with crops, uh, vegetation, how to uh, work the soil to create, to have better crops, okay? To have a variety of crops. And one of the things that he concentrated on, or two of the, the types of foods was sweet potatoes and peanuts. And he found various um, uses for peanuts and for uh, sweet potatoes, okay? So make sure you're reviewing the information still on these, on these men. Um, one of the things, his nickname was the plant doctor, don't forget that. And, um, he did pay through his own schooling, through his own education, by doing laundry for other students, so that's another important thing. Orville and Wilbur Wright, um, this right here is Kitty Hawk, North Carolina, it's about right there. That's where they had their famous flight um, when they were able to fly the airplane. <coughs> and, um, Orville was the first one that piloted, not Wilbur. So make sure you also learn that distinction because you will be tested on it again. Um, when, the, when the Wright brothers were very young, they had their own bike shop and they just kind of, uh, they were always very mechanical. That's one of the reasons that they created the, the, the airplane. And um, Jesse Owens and Jim Thorpe, were very, very famous uh, af athletes. Jesse Owens was the one that was responsible for winning four gold medals. And Jim Thorpe won, um, broke the high jump record in his high school. And um, Jim Thorpe even fought against or played against uh, the president of the United States, Dwight David Eisenhower. And he also became the president of the American Professional Football Association. Jim Thorpe became the president during his lifetime. And um, that's it for history.